gonna win. Uh, I think Cowboys we're gonna win. The Cowboys gonna win, boy. Hey, we're gonna make America great again. Who? The Cowboys gonna win. Not gonna win. How much y'all wanna bet? Man, dude is looking like an animal. Hey, who? Aaron Rodgers. Hey, look, that thing already hey. set up. Look, shut up. Hey, bro. Listen. Them Cowboys. Cowboys. Go. Is look. it Houston, too? They got to go to Dallas and win. I mean, I'm hoping to see a great game. Hey, man. Because that rookie deserves it. I ain't saying he don't. Bro. Cowboys are going to find a way to mess it up. If that throws out, I mean, if he goes out the first quarter, throws one pick, <laughs> we're going to sub him up for Romo. Oh, oh yeah. They're going to they gonna, they gonna put him no, back they will, in. They will, they they will sub him for Romo in. fast. They're going to put Romo back in. So, so any. Any, 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 any mistake wrong. that rookie makes, they're going to put Romo no, in that game. No, okay? <laughs> so we live. That'll be a slap in the face. Yes, yes. We are live. Yeah, you know. Um, hello, Facebook. Uh, we are live right now uh, with uh, the, the entrepreneur, the businessman, the man. The, the, I don't know. I don't know. There's, there's too many to, to call yeah. out. My man, Monty, from so Hang Time. How are you? Good man. My man, thanks for having me. Indianapolis, Appreciate Indiana, yes, representing. Yes, sir. Now, um, I only know of. Uh, wait, wait, first, I want to introduce us because I always, yeah. always just jump right in. But I'm Ray E. This is P. Wells. This is your boy Joke. And we are the great area. We now we are live right now with Monty from Hang Time, a local Indianapolis retail store. Uh, you know, is uh, I've heard a lot of great things. No, I appreciate that. And uh, I mean, uh, more, more, more things. Um, just, just every time I encounter someone or talk to someone, it's, it's nothing but good things. But there's oh, one yeah. thing for sure, is that the media isn't supporting, isn't supporting this, and, and that's a problem. Because I mean, and, and it, again, we've talked. This is this is not a big deal. You're not a media person. You're right, not a. Right. You don't need the publicity. Sure. Uh, sure. But I think it's important to recognize people who do things in our community. You know, it, it, it is. Yeah. It is, and it isn't at the same time because our duty as business owners in the community, I mean, you have to give back. Right. So, I mean... Say that again. As business owners in the community... You have to. It's a must. There it is. I mean, it's it's a must. I mean, these guys that, you know, patronize you, these guys that grew up under you, I mean, mm -hmm. but at the end of the day, yeah, the media is a game, mm -hmm. but, you know, when you do it for the community, the love of the community, right. ah, you know, do you care about the media? Sometimes, but mm -hmm. the only thing that kind of pisses me off is the media is if it's a negative bang, mm -hmm. they're there. All over it. All over, all over it. It's a problem all over. It is, it is. And I think they need to reverse that. Absolutely. They need to show what's positive. Not just what we're doing, but a lot, like, what this format, I mean. Absolutely. People need, you know, this is a, you know, mom and pop's format that's trying to grow. Right. So I think it, it needs to, the media is, I mean, you can't, you can't fight it. But at the end of the day, we do it for the community. We don't sure. do it for brownie points. We do it, you know, the city. They embraced us. We mm -hmm. embraced them. We love them. Yep. Uh, they love us. I mean, so I think it's time to get back, and I think it's uh, it's a new beginning. Absolutely. Uh, Good man. We appreciate the love too, brother. Yes, yes. Yeah. Sir. Um, yeah. I mean, yeah, let's absolutely. let's go to the beginning. Mm -hmm. I mean, and, and I know you're a private person. Sure. You know, generally you you know. People say this guy's, you know, arrogant. This guy's. I'm not. I mean, I'm I'm more humble, more laid back. You know. For sure. Uh, I'm not a flamboyant guy you know I'm not a media person I'm not a social media guy but I love people and I, right. I, I love my customers and I love the city and sure. I love my family I'm a family man right. how did how did you how did Monty get to Indy because I know he you know I know him a little bit more but yeah how'd yeah. you get to Indy like you know it's it's a it's a it's a crazy story it's it's uh I was supposed to end up in St. Louis honestly okay mm -hmm. uh I, long story short I was working at a deli in Hyde Park Chicago Obama Big yeah. ups to Mr. Obama. Hello. Hello. Yeah, hello. Hey. There it is. Um, working in a deli, you know, it was, uh, there was a store just buzzing. I mean, Tony Sports back in the days, mm -hmm. and he used to come in and buy these healthy shakes, you know, muscular guy. <laughs> yeah. So he seen me, you know, whatever it was, fixing his shelves, making his, whatever it was. Me and him kicked it off, and yeah. he needed good help, and, you know, he recruited me. And nice. I was like, wow, you know, Tony Sports, you know. This, nice. is, mm -hmm. this, is, this is the store. Right. right. So I worked from, you know, stock worked my way up. I mean, you know, long story short, I was dedicated to him, loyal to him. Right. Uh, a group of investors came in, they bought into uh, Tony's. Nice. So at the end of the day, I was running the show for him and mm -hmm. I lost my job in one day. Damn. Yeah, yeah, they sold the business. Wow. wow. I'll never forget that call, like 7 p.m. 
And uh, they were just, you know, like, yo, you, you know, I, I got an offer on the table, or yeah. what would you do? I said, yo, do you? Right. Wow. What wow. am I gonna do? So I woke mm -hmm. up the next day and I was getting calls left and right offers. And, yeah. And I said, you know what? I'm running a show for these guys. I gotta do me. Yeah. Nice. So long story short, I mean, God bless me with an investor. Mm -hmm. I spoke to Nike. Big ups to Nike, by the way. If it wasn't for Nike, I wouldn't be here. Really? Yeah. Yeah, Hello. Yeah, yeah, Explain. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm getting there. Okay. Brand Jordan. Oh. Hello. Uh, you're on. All you guys. I love you guys. I nice. Mean, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dope. If it wasn't for Nike, I wouldn't be here. Um, That's dope. Nike kind of, you know, we embraced each other. We said, okay, you know, they know me. I know them. You know, yo, go to St. Louis. St. Louis is an open market. Long story short, I go to St. Louis. I get to St. Louis. I just yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. He's St. Louis. He's St. Louis. Louis. Oh, man, this is, I just I woke yeah. up the next day in the hotel. And I was depressed. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I was flat land. I, I just couldn't do it. Yeah. Man. Second day, I just couldn't. I said, Yo, I called my you know my Nike dude. I was like, Yo, dog, what's up, man? I I don't see it. Mm. He's like, Yo, back then they used to have these guys, uh, Eakins. Mm -hmm. uh, they don't. I think they dissolved that position right now. Mm. They called it, you know, I got an Eakin Wayne for you in Indianapolis. I was like, yo, Indianapolis. I ain't never been there. How do I get there? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> 70. You know, How do so I get to Naptown? Back yeah. then, it was a MapQuest thing. Yeah. 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 I out the MapQuest joint, yeah. blah, blah, blah. And I think I met dude at the uh, Chuck E. Cheese on 38th. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Which no longer exists. Yeah. Right, correct. Yeah. 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 And there it is. Here we are. Wow. Yeah, yeah, we you know they embraced us and we embraced them and uh, and honestly it's it's big ups to Nike. Wow, yeah, wow. Yeah. So is this and your only my, store? Indianapolis, it yes. is. We yeah. uh, we branched out a bit to uh, Nashville, Tennessee. Okay. Mm -hmm. Beautiful, you know, loved it there. Yeah. Unfortunately, it's a different territory when it comes to business. Mm -hmm. You know, they protect us and obviously we fall into the Midwest. Right. So Nike will support us heavy here, but we were getting some love. Right. And wow. Nashville. Ah, there it is. So they took care of their own. Okay. Yeah. Nice. So we decided to pull back and focus here. Wow. For this is well, well, I can't say thank you. Thank you. you know, guys. Uh, no, I was I born in Chicago, but when I, after sorry. I was nine, I came. Yeah, <laughs> Cook County. Cook yeah, County, baby. Know. But, uh, you know, when we was about nine years old, I came here and kind of been here ever since. Nice. So I, I've grown to love this city. Listen, you know, hands down, so. you know, and I love Chicago guys and, and <laughs> when I go back to Chicago, it's two days and I'm back. This is home. <laughs> this is home. Appreciate this is home. that. That's true. Right. I agree. This yeah. Appreciate this is home. Appreciate it. I grow up here. That. We know a lot of I people think here. It's yeah. The only thing I don't like about this city, and we were raised that way, mm. it's a bit segregated still. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. It is. Oh, yeah. We didn't know what segregation was. I mean, mm. you know, whether you're black, white, Puerto Rican, you know, yeah. we didn't care. Right. Yeah. We ain't got a lot of culture, brother. Yeah. In a bigger city, you tend to be the food, the food, the food, the food. Uh, These are, yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, we just talked about that, but it, yeah, I mean, I like food. Chicago because it's a mini, no, uh, it's a mini New York to me. Word on the street is Portillo's is coming. Uh oh, oh wow! What? Yeah, nine hundred sixteen. Got Chicago's pizza up on the north side. Giordano's. Yeah. Giordano's. Yeah. Yeah. But Indy is Indy special, uh, yeah. especially for the family. People here are more humble. So uh, what? Yeah. So what's your uh, being an entrepreneur, so you probably was young when you was in the in oh, working yeah, in the stock yeah. store. in the stock room, man. I'll never forget that ladder, man. <laughs> uh, but I love it. I love it. I, I respect it. I respect the box. I respect the stock room. I mean, Sweet. I wasn't you, handed nothing. A lot of guys that come in the store and think it was, I was, I was handed nothing. There you yeah. go. Cause you got, some, hey, you got a mean team, boy. Yes, sir. Big ups to my story. team. If it wasn't for my team, there is no hang time. Hey, wow. that team yeah, is nice. Right. Team. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shout out to the hang time yes. team. I love my Don't guys to death. I mean, so how my you? brother. Big ups to him. He's a big part of my success. Family, family. Yeah. Nice. What's your advice for uh, young entrepreneurs? I know you get a lot of. Yeah. A lot of people that come in there, a lot of people come talk to you. What's your advice to a young entrepreneur trying to... You got to try, man. If you don't try and you don't have heart, forget it. It's not about the dollar, man. I mean, you can have money and don't know what to do with it. You yeah. got you to gotta have heart. You got to go work. I busted my tail 13, 14 hours a day. Right. You got to get it. You got to do it right. Yeah. And don't be scared. Absolutely. I mean, that's the thing. You can't be scared. And do it the honest way. Right. Mm -hmm. Honesty is key, man. And... and that's what I love about my customers, and, and they, I'm pretty sure they live about us. I mean, I'm, right. I'm as honest as they come with them, man. And I'm not out to eat nobody's dollar. That's dope, man. It's, yeah. just, it's, it's hard to come by people yeah. with, with that thought. My process. faith, man. You know, I'm a Muslim. I mean, right. number one, that comes before anything. God before right. anybody. There you go. Right. Yeah, man. If you don't have God in your life, 
He sees everything. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He sees everything. And, and then he leads the way. I mean, I don't care who you believe in. He leads the way to, to a happy life. Right. Absolutely. Uh, yeah. So, I mean, in, in branching off of that, let's talk about uh, what you did locally here. Sure. Uh, 22 families. Yes. Uh, just a, a work of charity. Yes. I mean, and this, this, is, this wasn't a Christmas act. Yeah. This was uh, just a, a charitable yeah. act by a man. Honestly, it goes back to my childhood. I mean, it goes back to my mother. I love her to death. Uh, it goes back to uh, my wife's family. I mean, everybody struggled. We struggled. We all struggled. Yeah. And it was funny. You know, I'd, I'd sit in some events when I was young, and, you know, you'd want to give back, and sure. but you didn't have the needs or the funds. And I always told myself, if, if, if the man upstairs put me on the platform, I'm going to make it happen. Absolutely. Right. Yeah. And, and, and Indianapolis, we're going to make it bigger. I mean, our goal is to get it to 100K. Right. 100K. Awesome. Yeah. You do the math on how many families you could feed. Wow. Yeah. And this is just a start. I mean, it's something that I think we're obligated to do, and it's something that we'd love to do. For mm -hmm. sure. And I think we want to be an icon as in giving back in the city. Man, that's incredible. And that's just that's just a start, and I think we have a lot of a lot of future ahead of us. That's awesome. Yeah. And I mean, Hang oh, Time is a, is a is a prime time store. Mm -hmm. You know, like you know, I don't know who doesn't shop there. Hey, can uh, I tell a story about that? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Yo, I used to ride past Hang Time all the time. It was like, <laughs> only because of that block, though. Like, yeah. I was like, man, I ain't shopping on that block, man. <laughs> like, I know what the next, I know what that building is next to the block, on that block, man. And I was right. like, man, what the hell is Hang Time? Like, mm -hmm. everybody's Hang Time, man. Get your tickets to go to the concerts here, here, Hang Time, Hang Time. <laughs> and then one day, I was like, you know what? I'm about, to bust, I'm about to bust off up in here one day. Mm -hmm. I popped off in there. I was like, yo, what the Pretty nice, bro. You yeah, know what if it wasn't for the loyalty of the customers, yeah, yeah. You, it, it, there is no hang time. Yeah, I mean, it is. It's, yeah. it's, uh, it's, it goes both ways. I mean, business is two way. Yeah, yeah. You know, you can have a lot of Mercedes Benz, and if mm -hmm. you ain't got the customer service and the honesty, you're gonna, they're just going to sit there. Yeah. yeah. Keep it yeah. real with you guys and just move on. Yeah. yeah. You know, but again, it, you know, okay, we're an icon. I respect that. Thank God. But at the end of the day, use that icon to a uh, a positive advantage and that's mm -hmm. why I woke up that day I said you know what let's do this right and hopefully that's just the beginning right and I'm promising you guys it's just the beginning oh, that's that's awesome. Awesome. Yeah, we're not gonna stop there's a lot of people in need out there you'll be surprised man yeah you'll be surprised sometimes we get caught up in vacations we get yeah. caught up in you know just laying at home watching your you know big screen TVs and right. you forget mm -hmm. about it but when you start digging mm -hmm. oh man yeah them 22 families touch my heart Man, it touched my heart. Yeah, I mean, man. I mean, Same here. I, it's unheard Same of here. in this city. It's touched my unheard heart. Of. At the end of the day, that each one has its own unique story, and yeah, and, and you know what? And it wasn't a minority thing. And we reached out to white, Mexican, uh, African Americans. Sure. I mean, but next time, it, it I want to make it bigger. That's just awesome. put a smile on these kids' faces. Big ups to B Swift. Big B -Swift ups to the Turtles. Yeah. Sherry Bell, Chanel, mm. Fee. I could go on and on and awesome. on. Sauce. Yeah. The bus company. Yeah. Team. Worm, yeah. Chick-fil-A. I mean, you know, Brand Jordan, I salute you. Wow. Yeah, they came through, and hopefully uh, next year they want to go big with us. That's yeah. awesome, Yeah, and if we can help in any way, man. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 It's definitely uh, a part of it. Honestly, the smile on the kids. I mean, Walmart, big ups to Walmart. We yeah. made a chaotic scene in there. But <laughs> <laughs> the Turtles, man, those guys, I don't know if you're familiar with the local guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Nitty and those guys. Yeah. Salute those guys. There those guys. Yeah, incredible. Wow. Famous. Man, yeah. You need them on yeah. the show. There you go. Nitty right. Turtles. Nitty Turtles. We're going to have to get the Turtles those on Those guys right. are, wow. <laughs> Salute is. those guys. I mean, if I missed anybody, I'm sorry. I love you guys. And, and, and especially, you know, Sherry Bell. Thanks for your help. Yeah. Everybody. B Swift. All you guys. I mean, you guys are great. I mean, incredible people. People. Mm -hmm. And, and, and. And I, I'll say that it's the people around you and that I that I talk to and that I, I mean I heard nothing bad. Yeah, it's at all. always been good and stuff. That, and that speaks volumes, you know, because you know you you tend to when you hear from some about somebody or talk about somebody, at least the ten out of the ten things you probably hear one bad thing. But I haven't heard anything no, bad. That's a blessing from God. Yeah. I mean, come to that, thank God. But at the end of the day, be humble, man. Yeah. Anybody can go tomorrow, man. I mean, right. yes, sir. Money come and go. Right. I seen it. I came from nothing. Mm -hmm. Just because you get a you know a few coins in your pocket, you're not superior, man. Yeah, that could get taken away tomorrow. It's, it's who you are, and it's your it's your upbringing too. It's what your mom taught your wife. I, you know, I love my wife to death. You know, if you listen, I love you. I mean, she's humble. Crush. Yeah, 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 yeah. My kids. I mean, 
you got to be humble, man. You, you can't Absolutely. forget. You know, a lot of people say that. They want to put on T-shirts. Mm -hmm. And I and I live by it. That's all. Awesome. Don't forget where you come from. For, for business uh, for business and growth, and we're going back to the business part of it, how long did it take you to kind of, from where you started to, to you got enough momentum to where you were, like, comfortable that the store is, is profiting? A lot of people oh, man. in this day and age are starting up businesses, and they get so... Um, you know, so down and out because they don't understand that it takes time. So, you know what? You know, I mean, we started in 2004. What are we in 16 going? What are we yeah, 17? 17. 17. Yeah, 17. 17. 17. 17. Yeah. So we're like 13 years. Yeah. Oh man. If my wife's listening, she's gonna probably kill me. I just started. <laughs> I just started taking two days off a week. Nice. Yeah. Wow. 13 years later. Mm. So it's it's you know you're talking about you know family values you're losing you you know your kids growing up. Yeah. It's it's tough. Right. You know you're talking about stress test right you're talking about staying up late you're talking about worrying i mean yeah. Yeah. there's a lot to it a lot of right. trust too though a lot yeah. of trust take right. a lot to that's why i love my out. team i mean all you guys at the shops man you guys i mean jonah steve t ron my brother like i said chris yeah. uh if it wasn't for them there's no hang time man I, you can't be selfish right yeah. you gotta have something like you guys look at you guys like brothers mm -hmm. absolutely yeah. if it wasn't like i just asked who's the tech guy yeah, I mean, you know, there's a team. Yeah, there's a team. A, yeah. yeah, everybody has a role. Absolutely. No Absolutely. ego. Throw that ego out the window. Out the window. Absolutely. It's not necessary. You know, and that's and that's you know like the main reason why, or part of the main reasons why we created this whole platform. Oh. Man. Right. You know, um, you know, we all have big hearts. Um, you know, with the right you know mindset. You know, the right perspectives. On, well, you, know, you got my back. support, man, and I and I love what you guys are doing, and I think uh, consider me as a. A silent partner for free. There you go. You yes, know, I mean, we appreciate any, that, anything I could help in us as a hang time group, I mean, I think your platform is dope. Thank you. And I hope it grows. And I hope one day I can be sitting on the couch with you all these dudes just sold for like 20 million. Boy, <laughs> what are you talking about, bro? <laughs> like, hey, thanks for speaking that into the existence, man. You know, you know, like, that's, dude, that's going. Yes, sir. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> now, I, I got a question, man. How did, sure. you, how did you come up with the name? Like, I'm always in the people ESPN. come up with the name. Honestly, ESPN. ESPN. Jordan. What? No. I was watching TV no. in Kentucky, man, and you know, okay. my investor, my partner, my cousin. Mm -hmm. We're just going back and forth, you know, and, and I seen that. I think it was Dominique Wilkins or something. I don't know who it was. It was just ESPN. I'm an ESPN junkie, man. And yeah. I could just have it on for 24 hours. Oh, we got to bring yeah. him in for the sports segment, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. You need to bring my brother in, man. Your brother uh, be going. Yeah, his brother, his brother be on it, bro. Yeah, his brother yeah. be on it. Yeah. But, and I just said, hang time. And it felt funny. Yeah, but now it's just like it's on it's it's my good. chest, it's in my heart. Yeah, it's it's good. Good. It's yeah, it is. So it's, it's dope. What a brand! I mean, like it started from basically nothing, and now it's just it literally was. And wow. you know, Tony, I respect Tony. He's a big chain in Chicago. You know, much respect to him for having the mm -hmm. faith in me, and I worked my way up, and I, I truly did work. That's one thing. During the event, you know, long story short, you know, my brother was tweeting, or you know, he's 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 our social guy. Big yeah. ups to Ron too. I mean, I love him yeah. to death. My brother, he's he's huge with this. Mm -hmm. um, he was tweeting, you know, Monty's. I said, yo, cut that Monty out. You know, it's not a Monty. It's not a Monty thing. It's it's a us thing. It's a team. Mm -hmm. So you know, being called as an owner, or being like, yeah, all right, throw it out the window. Right. There you go. Team yeah. player. That's yeah. cool. Man. Yeah. yeah. Partner. Yeah. That's what it's all about, man. Yeah. If you don't have soldiers, you. Yeah, surrounding yeah. yourself with like-minded individuals mm -hmm. and I mean and, and, and this is another thing that I think people get mixed up is leadership oh, man. leadership yeah. leadership and I say this over and over again leadership has nothing to do with self it has everything to do with building up the people around you yeah. around that's, that's that's how you get a, you yeah. get a leader yeah. you know but you know there's a lot of people who become self-absorbed and they get to a certain oh, height caught up in the game, game and, 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 and they lose it's, it. it's, I mean Dame and Jay I mean prime example and I was yeah. a big Dame fan yeah. right but yeah. You know, if you look at the videos, I mean, one was aggressive. Yeah. The other was way back. And one right. was way back. Right. Exactly. Right. You know, so what happened at the end? Right. Right. But if you look at Dame's tone back in the day, he was aggressive. And, you know, right. you can't be disrespectful. I mean, that's just yeah. how I feel. Right. right. Yeah, you know, a lot of people are going to say, yo, Monty's an ass. But at the end of the day, you got to put your foot down. You got to put your foot down. Sometimes you, know you got to have that, yeah. that conversation. It's uh, uncomfortable. People have to learn. And then we got to get away from this as a people. We have to get away from this, like, like if we have a disagreement with somebody, 
we can't turn it into um. I don't oh, like it. I don't have with this person. <laughs> oh, yeah. listen, I mean, listen, it's, listen, it's, that's it's, uh, yeah. I mean, it's a problem. And to the youth out here, man, there's a yeah. lot of good dudes out here, man. Right. So, you right. know, and, and and the city. I mean, Indianapolis, Chicago. Yeah. Yo, I mean, just put them guns down, man. Ex- absolutely. Yeah, this yeah. shit's not worth it, man. Right. It's it's it's, 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 it's not worth. You think it's an environment thing? So let's talk about that. You know, because. The crime, even in Indianapolis, the crime spiked. Yeah. You know, and I and I honestly believe it's it's from some some areas like Chicago, Gary. You know, right, people it migrating. Is, it is, it is. You know, Kentucky, Memphis. A lot of people tend to come here to hide out. Yeah. You know, and that kind of spills over sometimes. <laughs> sure. I mean, they do. They come here to hide out because it's the in between. You know. You know what so, it is these days. I think, uh, you know, back then, you know, we used to walk down the block or through the alley. If you see somebody deaf, you know, you, either you get beat up or you beat him up but the next day you look at him you're deaf and you move on right yeah. mm-hmm. these sure. days it's, it's just sickening man and i'm sorry to say it man it's all minority yeah it's it not is. just the african-american community i mean if you go to the city it's everybody right but Crazy. and people when people hear minority they think black but no. a, a, a person who is ignorant would only think that mm-hmm. so you might know it is a multicultural there you go yes, yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, there yeah, you that's go. what i'm saying we fall into that category I absolutely mean, you know, us Hispanics, Puerto Ricans, Dominicans, yeah. I mean, African Americans, I yeah. mean, you know, e- even a white race, I mean, it's just all over right now, and it's, it's disgusting, it's, it yeah. needs to stop, but, you know. You think the media has a lot to do with, you know, putting that subliminally in people's head about that it's, it's, it's a big race war? Racism ain't going nowhere, man. Right. Yeah. Uh, you know, unfortunately, it's under the rug, and it comes out the closet every blue moon. Sure. And, and comes out, but at the end of the day, it's, uh, it ain't going nowhere. Right. And, you know, my Muslim sisters, man, you just got to stay strong on it because we're eating it right now. Right. You know, I mean, African Americans ate it back in the days, and, mm-hmm. you know, we're, 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 that's why we, unfortunately, I mean, we fear with each other. Right. I mean, mm-hmm. it's, it's yeah. you know, and, 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 and no race is better than any other race. Right. But you just have to... You gotta fight for what's right. You have to learn to build. I think at the end of the day, everybody is protecting, you know, their their heritage, you know, in some form or fashion. Nobody wants to be eliminated, no. you know. But I think they get that mixed up with the misconception that, you know, it's revenge or you know they don't understand that everybody's kind of fighting for their own thing, you know. But I think the it's media respect, makes that, the, the, makes the, that the media, man, the media is <sighs> crazy. Yeah. The media is <laughs> a beast. You know what I mean? The media is a beast. Yes. It's crazy. I think the media, if you if you watch it long enough, you start believing it. I always go back to, like my grandmother told me, the television is a lie. It's mm-hmm. going to always lie to you. You tell me one thing about the television, it's not a lie. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah you know, in the media. You got to be careful what you watch. The media yeah. is going to make I mean, you know, and, and I don't like throwing a race card thing, right? And we're right. talking about sure. business. But I want to give sure. you guys a prime example. Okay. I mean, you know, obviously my prayers go out to the families of Florida that the other day at the airport, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. And dude was a cycler. He's a, he's right. a coward. He's whack. He's right. garbage. Mm-hmm. Now, if that was one of us, mm-hmm. it'd be terrible. Oh, man, it'd be terrible. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's crazy. You know? But but they find ways to do it. He's you know? mental ill. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He, he, he crazy. But, but I mean, you know, you don't, you don't okay that with, I don't care what race you are. I mean, that could have right. been your mom. That could have been your sister. For that sure. could have been your neighbor. I mean, you could be white, black. Nobody decides. Right. You know, nobody right. deserves to just get popped in the head. Absolutely. No matter what race you are. Listen, human is. life is precious, man. Yes, I don't care who you are. Very, very so the youngsters put them guns down. Period. Man. For sure, it's they not to put them down. Yeah. I mean, and uh, so hang time is in an area that you know some would consider kind of, right. kind of iffy. Do Do you fear, or you know, what kind, what first, what kind of things do you do in that area to kind of like you know protect your your investment? And do you? You know what the have, truth is? Yeah. Respect. It's respect. There it is. Uh, you want the truth? Simple. Yeah. Respect. There it is. Respect. I mean, obviously, you know, you, you're going to protect yourself. Right. Just like you're going to protect your household. Right. Mm-hmm. But to me, it's a respect thing. There it is. Treat yeah. people with respect. You could go to Mars. Mm-hmm. You'll get respect. Absolutely. And that's a conversation that, you know, I think police officers tend to miss. It's all about respect. You know, we can't say that enough. You know, if you if you gain the respect of your community and, and those around you, then you, you never have to worry about anything. It's know? funny. The other day it was... Uh, uh, IMPD uh, African American uh, sergeant came in. Yep. She was getting food from next door. She was shopping for Christmas. And yeah. I was like, "Why are you guys so underscored? And you guys are doing you, no community outreach, no nothing. I, I don't. Right. 
Well, they're saying they're understaffed. I mean, I don't see a big piece. No, right? <laughs> no, they are. You know, right. and, you know, I'm right. not knocking them, but sure. get community act. Get get mm -hmm. more active with the community. You got to. You have to. Everybody. Yeah. Even us. I mean, we have to get more active. Yeah. Absolutely. You got to be in a you know, community. I mean, we do. We do. We. I mean, everybody leaders. has to get active. You everybody has to. a role. Everybody yeah. got a role. You know. I mean, yeah, it you takes, know, we're all it connected. Takes it takes a village. Yeah, it's like a we're, puzzle. We're all connected. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. I tell everybody, if they could use my name on a platform to, to draw a piece or to draw, I, they could use it. Yeah. Yeah. I don't care. I mean, I don't care. I mean, I'm not an egotistic guy. Use it all you want, as long as it's for a good cause. For a good cause, it. yeah. That's amazing. Man. I'm game. Let's go. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. I got a question. Like, how do, you, how do you, I go back to the business and the store, you know. How do you keep it fresh? Like, cause I know you've seen OCD, man. fashion trends change. Like, how do you keep it? Like, how do you keep current. up with the fashion? Yeah, current. Current. Honestly, fresh, I right? mean, how right. do you know? How do you know? Like, all right, this is gonna sell at my store. Right, the key, the key, the key versus Macy's or something. The key, uh, the key to this business is you can't order what you like. Yeah. If you order what you like, my brother is so fashion forward. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's he's just got a Great eye. Okay. But I can't put him behind the desk and order sometimes. He's too fast. <laughs> <laughs> He's doing some Paris looking. I, you can't. You gotta know the consumer. Yeah. And trade shows, man. It's all about trade. You gotta yeah. travel. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm mm -hmm. traveling 15, 20 shows a year. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. You know, I got a travel bag at home. You know, this wow. is our season right now. Like, how, how many travel shows you you go to a year? About 15 to 20. 15 to 20. Yeah. Yeah. Sweet. If you're in retail, you that's not get... that's not counting the overseas ones. Overseas, if you want to. Take it to another level. There, yeah, there it is. There it is. What kind of places you go to? I mean, like, I mean, because the world is big. It's big, but not every trend fits everywhere. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's okay. tough, man. It's not easy. I mean, yeah. and we're not a Macy's, we're not a Dillard's. We right. can't return product. We can't mm -hmm. say, hey, this is not selling. We'll take it back. Right. So you know, a lot of people see a markdown, you know, uh, racks, and they, oh, this is old. You better take advantage of it. That's good stuff. <laughs> hey, I right. know that. I, I'm always on that board. I'm not scared yeah. to take a loss. Hey, I'll take yeah. some stuff yeah. from last year's fashion and wear it this year. Yeah. Yeah. You know, Tripping. But fashion is so clean these days. Yeah. It's, I'm loving it right now. It's cleaner. Yeah. It's uh. It's, it's simple, man. Yeah, it's it's yeah. Guys are less baggier. Yeah. Um, yeah. A lot of my mature customers, man. This is what they want. A lot of good mature guys out there. A lot of guys that. Want to lay back, kick back. They don't want the yeah. violence. They don't want a lot of good dudes in Indianapolis. Mm -hmm. Indy, stand up, man. A lot of yeah, good dudes. Yeah. Appreciate, it. appreciate. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, yeah, a lot of good dudes in there. And yeah. Indy is a great city, and uh, we got a lot of good customers. Even our female customers, some of them are paying, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> as a female yeah, customer, you know, man. it's uh, it is what it is. What the what the, what the people got to say, um, right? We have a question from my feed. She says, "Do you sell women's fashion too, or only men?" Ah, uh, men only. Man, right no. women's is a tough market. Women is a tough market. Yeah, man. If you want to go all in, you got to go all in with yeah, with yeah. focus on right. what you want to do. You have more success with the men. Yes, women's is is they can go to H and M and look good. Mm -hmm. Women's shoes. Women do have a lot what of shoes. shoes. Women got a lot of stores, but I don't think it's enough. Kids, I mean, it's yeah. more kids driven shoes. Oh, okay. Yeah. okay. Grade school, toddler, mm -hmm. okay. men's. Yeah, but women's is a whole different. That's a tough market. Retail is tricky in itself it is, it is, because it is, it is. you have to, as a as a as a store owner, you have to decipher the the, the fake and and quality over, you know, what's real and what's not quality. You know, like how do honestly, you, guys like us, you know, we don't, you know, we're direct with every company, so I don't, you know, that there that is. knockoff stuff, and I, you know, I that never was in it, never right. will be. It's mm -hmm. not our cup of tea. Right. I mean, you want to listen. You want premium product. You want a premium store. Yeah. You got to do it the premium way. You heard it there first. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, yeah. I don't <laughs> you heard it there first. Just you know, that's the only way. Quality over quantity. Quality, man. It's yeah. uh, you know, this. Uh, you can. You got to be premium. Good. That's Sweet. good. That's good to hear, man. Because there's mean, a lot of people that have stores and they they choose to. I don't know where they get this stuff from. You know, it's yeah. good to hear about. A you know, you, you know, if you, you could. We're vendor nationwide, man. I yeah. mean, like I said, big ups to Nike. Big ups to. Mm -hmm. Brand Jordan, Adidas, yep. I mean, all these guys, I mean, mm -hmm. you know, they support us head to toe. Yeah. I mean, you're going to get your dumb dumbs every blue moon and of throw course. a monkey wrench, of but, course. you know, yeah. right. that comes with the territory. Right. Dumb dumbs, man. Let's, uh, <laughs> 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 I mean, let's touch on that, man, because, like, you know, one of the reasons why we wanted you here, um, you know, I had tagged these, you know, you know, these guys, man. You know, there's a post that I had saw. 
uh, on Facebook like a few weeks yeah, back, yeah, yeah. talking about like the fake sure. Jordans. And you know, I've been to your store once. Sure. But when I saw that, I said, you know, this is bullshit, man. You, you know, know what? At the end of the day, you can't control. That's why I don't like social media because yeah. I'm the type of dude. I'm, I'm, uh, my heart and soul is into the business. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. yeah. And uh, when when you get insults like that, all it does is give you energy. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. I can tell you this, mm -hmm. man. I mean. The day you, you find me unlegitimizing my business or mm -hmm. giving you some fake product is the day I hand you the keys and you can have the store. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's like that. You know, come on, man. I mean, yeah, you can, you know, I, 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 honestly, you know, and I, and, I, and I, truthfully, I addressed the gentleman professionally, mm -hmm. but when I see where he was going, I mean, you know, I said, you know, God bless you, man. And, some uh, people just want attention. Exactly. Yeah. You know, yeah. And you know what? And, and big ups to the city. They did stick up for us heavily. Mm -hmm. and, yeah. And at the end of the day, I mean, sometimes you don't have to stick up for something that's, you know, you're like, ah, brush it off. But sometimes it, it kind of hurts you because, you know, why are you even going there? Why, why would you do that? Yeah. yeah. You know, and, and I specifically told this person that, yo, the people that you're not going to help me feed 22 people tomorrow. Nice. Yeah, so, so nice. yeah, you know, so yeah. what was the whole purpose of doing that? <laughs> Attention. You know what? Attention, yeah. At the end Absolutely. of the day, you know what? You know? That's his opinion. Yeah. But you can't, you know, it's freedom of speech. I mean, if that's what he wants to do, yeah. that's what he wants right. to do. But you know what, hang time is yeah. is 100% genuine, 100%. I mean, you could you could call Nike, Adidas. I mean, I, I can't even believe we're even talking about it. It's yeah, something, yeah. Right? Right. It's yeah, something you know, that yeah. I wasn't raised into. I mean, if you right. look up Tony Sports back, and he was a prime, mm -hmm. prime store in Chicago. I mean, mm -hmm. so you're going to get that. Right. You know, yeah. that comes with the territory, <coughs> like you said earlier. It comes, it comes with, with the territory. You're going to get people that just... And you know what, and guys like that, you embrace with your heart. Yo, what's up? How you doing? You know, God bless you. That's what's up, man. If that's how you feel. Yeah, you keep it moving. Absolutely. Yeah. But, you know what, I mean, is he going to pay my uh, $150,000 Nike bill? If he wants to do that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Go ahead. Man. I'm just being honest with you. I mean, you know, yeah. we lose sleep with these Nike and the Jordan bills right. and the Adidas bills. I, I'm not going to address or entertain something like that. I mean, right. yeah. my sneaker heads, my guys, they know what's up, man. I mm -hmm. mean, yep. it's, it's something. How do you answer something like that? Right. Yeah. It, yeah. I mean, put yourself in my shoes. What do you say? And it's usually, it's usually people chiming in on stuff like that that have no idea who you are or about your store. Probably never stepped in your store. Probably so. You know, unfortunately, I mean, it's, you know, we had the same situation from the same person two years ago. Mm, okay. And, you know, mm -hmm. Wow. It's a recurrence, huh? So it's, uh, God bless him, man. And, you know, I, I and I pray for him. And honestly, I don't wish no ill will on him. I, I, I wish him the best because that's yeah. not how you, if, if I don't like something, Duke God or Duke don't like, I mean, let's talk about it. Talk about it, yeah. Give yeah, me a hug right. and move on. You don't like it, that's on you because yeah. you don't like it. Absolutely. You know what I mean? So. That's what this world is missing, man, is an open forum, man. Let's talk Absolutely. about it. Yeah, the yeah, great area. Come great to area. the great area and <laughs> talk <laughs> about it, Monty. That's why you're here. And Come I, to the I, great and I, area. And I appreciate you bringing that up. But at the end yeah, of the day, it's, yeah. and honestly, big ups to the city. I mean, they, 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 they shut that down quick, man. And yeah, I mean, I'm, listen, I mean, I read it and was just like, man, God. You know, here we go. You One know thing I mean? you do have is the city. No, I, I do. Yeah, right, yeah, absolutely. People, do. people city, go to bat and do it. And the city ain't seen nothing yet. This well, is uh, yeah, yeah, better speaking, get ready. Speaking yeah. of the city, do you get a lot of? Uh, I don't know how you keep up with your your customer things. Like, do you get a lot of people from around the state yes. that come? Yes, sir. Mm. Fort Wayne, Fort Wayne, Big Fort Wayne, Bloomington. No, I don't know about Bloomington. We get more uh, Fort Wayne, Charleston, um, Anderson, oh, South Bend. Nah, yeah, a few South Bend. Oh, okay. We get a lot of animals. Kokomo. Kokomo, okay. okay. That's good. Uh, Muncie. Muncie. Mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, yeah, Fort Wayne, especially Fort Wayne. Wow. Yeah, That's good. I mean, it's, I love those guys in little pocket rural areas. I mean, some good dudes come out of there. That's cool. Yeah, That's good cool. families, too. I mean, Christmas time, we have a handful of families that are loyal to us. Okay. So big ups to all you rural areas, outskirts, mm. Anderson, Kokomo, so you got a, Muncie. Uh, yeah. It's hang time online or just it's store just for only? Like, you know what? Online is a business by itself, man. And mm -hmm. then you got to get approvals. I mean, it's mm -hmm. not that easy. I mean, gotcha. Nike has to approve it. Jordan has to approve it. Mm -hmm. Adidas has to approve it. Gotcha. So apparel is pretty easy to put on there. With footwear, it's all approval. Gotcha. You know, so, I mean, it's, uh, we got Instagram. It's hang time, I-N-D-Y. I mean, yes, that's our bread and butter. I mean, yeah. right now. Twitter. Twitter, Twitter uh, hang time, I-N-D-Y. Yeah. Uh-oh, uh, some people today they they time, love you, Monty. Uh-oh, we love you, Monty. Oh, man. Uh, who is your favorite Ramadan, Ramadan. brother? Get rid of Monty, that's who's my your brother. favorite that's, brother? That's the sports guy. <laughs> What's up, Monty? <laughs> who's your favorite brother? Don't mess this up, brother. Assalamu alaikum. There you go. That's, 
that's that's what it is, man. And, and you it's know, I'm, love, man. You I'm know. his favorite yeah. brother <laughs> from another mother. Yeah, I love what you guys are doing. I, I think this appreciate is appreciate it, man. Appreciate, appreciate it, man. Yeah, yeah, man. We really, really appreciate it. I like that. the uh, who came up with the name. I did. I can say my man right here came up with the name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 A lot of great. He was arguing about something one day. So, what do you guys think about the election, man? Tell me, man. Oh my God. Uh, you want me to go first? Interview yeah, yeah, you go first. Okay, I'll go first. Uh, <laughs> but but before you speak, okay. Man, yes. you know, I, I, I don't care. You know, I love Obama, okay? Uh -huh. Regardless of his, mm -hmm. yeah, whatever he thinks of. Like, yeah. It's my yeah. man, I salute him. We're going to miss him. Yeah. But the sad thing about it is the people spoke. Yeah. Yeah. That with, electoral. With a, help, with a little help from Russia. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that electoral <laughs> votes, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> ah. I mean, should that be changed? Man, should it be changed? Ooh. That's hard to do. Uh, That's see, hard they, to do because see, they, you know, they won't do that, man. No, uh, they're not gonna no change. he didn't say will they. He said should it be Maybe. changed. I, I think so. I think any any intervention Why? from from another anything that tampers with uh, a United States election should be reevaluated, and and things should be provoked, and people should be fired. Now, because here's the thing, if if this wasn't Trump, and it was someone else. Everything in their power would have been done to be to remove this person. But now I like some things about Trump. I hate some things about Trump. I'll tell you what I do like about Trump before I get to the hate part. <laughs> <laughs> what I do like about Trump is he says whatever the heck he wants. Yes, but a little he, bit you know, too much uncut. A little bit too much uncut. For and, a president to be presidential, right? To be yeah, to be to be the president of the United States yeah, yeah. is is unreal because we well, had a president like Obama who was just classy and, and cordial, oh, and then man, you got a guy who just play his part, man, just whatever. Play his part. So you know, don't forget Uncle Joe, <laughs> uh, Joe Biden, the man. Oh, yeah. So some things I do, I, you know, um, you know, I like about Trump is he is a good, he is a businessman. Whether he does it illegally or whatnot, I think that. I think that he has some sort of idea about business, and if you don't have a business right now, you need to go get a tax ID, you go to the Secretary you of State, so? get a business, and jump in the game. You think so? Yeah, I think so. I don't think so. I think so. But this is what this mm. is what I don't like about Trump. I don't like how he won the election. I don't like that he uses fear-based, uh, fear-mongering to ignite uh, a crowds of people, and they, I mean, like, lock Hillary up, you know, uh, you know, I mean, build a wall. I mean, this is not natural for an election or for people to win in the United States. It's just you're 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 building people up to to lie to them. And after the election, guess what? He's not going to build the wall. Oh, he's already said he's asking I mean, Congress for money. Yeah, yeah, Congress yeah, yeah, wants Congress that. to build yeah. the wall. You know what? I, I, yeah. I, I don't want to say no because I don't want him to buy the corn of thirty eight million. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta go. No, you gotta go. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Put me a tower. But right but but from what I heard, Pence is a brain. Oh, yeah. Naptown. Yeah. yeah. I mean, that's what they want to I heard, I mean, I don't know my politics here, and I, I can yeah. care less, but I heard Indiana's at a surplus. I mean, it's not hurting. Mm -hmm. I heard he did a great job, so I don't know. I mean, I heard he's a brain, so I have no clue. It's 50 50. You got yeah, a lot of people in sure Indianapolis that don't like I'm sure he's a political brain. Yeah. yeah, I mean, come on. I mean, I got, I got a story hey, about Penn you said job, but, you know. You said it earlier. Put a good team around you. Yeah. You can win, yeah, bro. I mean, I, I personally think. That night when they went to the war room, that they didn't even think they were gonna win. I don't think they think they were gonna win. Exactly. No. You know what? But they like, yo, we got lucky. Let's the man go. won. Let's run. We got to deal with it. We got four years. I'm gonna miss the hell out of Obama. Uh, it's uh, Michelle. I mean, it's it, the White House. Good family. Is nice family. Yeah. Good family. Cordial. You know. Chicago man, stand up. I mean, this guy is global. I mean, do I mean, you think? Do you think he'll go back no. to Chicago? He can't. All right, do you think he'll help the community with yeah, what's going a, on in Chicago? Uh, he's building, he's spending, uh, don't quote me, some millions and millions. He's doing this resource center. Okay. Yeah, he's breaking ground, or I don't know if it's broke ground or whatever, but I just, they just interviewed him, his last interview. And, uh, mm -hmm. uh, you think that's going to cut down, help cut down some of the crime and stuff in Chicago? Man, that's good. Because y'all up there, hey, Chicago over put you. Chicago's wilding now. Wow, West up here, brother. 70-something murders, I yeah. 70-90-something, yeah. One year, that's, that's what it is. You know what it is, guys? 
You need God in your life, man. Absolutely, man. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Absolutely. Yeah, you got to have a higher power. Well, if you got a problem, with just, just come duke it out, man. Leave your guns at home, man. I, I mean. <laughs> so, so you think it's cool? Well, speaking of that, that's what Chris Brown and Soulja Boy are doing. How's that? Is that oh, really getting in the ring? Pay per view. Hey, listen, Why, that is where's hilarious. the money going? I have no clue yet. I don't that's know. what I'm saying. 50, my man, 50 <laughs> behind it. 50 might be good. Well, yeah. Mike Tyson is going to Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson's training in one of them. He's, uh, no, uh, boy. I'd like to see the money go to charity. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Donate it. Exactly. I mean, because both of y'all got money. Everybody involved exactly. got money. Just donate to charity. Yeah, that's right. That's, that's one thing I'd love to do here, and I'm, I'm not scared to pull the trigger, but I think I want to do a peace island. Mm. Some crazy, I, I got some crazy ideas. Mm. Let but, us know. We're yeah, I, I need to, uh, I need to, I just, it has to be peaceful. Gotcha. Right. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? We need more of that. You know, because, I mean, th this year, this was a tough year. I mean, so many things happened. You know, the, 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 the racial conflicts. I think people are at a point where. Racism sucks, where, man. It's yeah. The, 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 we're at a point, especially the African-American community, where, like, marching Ooh. is tiresome. You know, trying to prove that it starts with the march, man. Something. Forget the marching, man. The marching right. is dumb. Yeah. We did all that. You know, yeah. man, you know, right. not like you know. For an example, uh, more Ferguson. Yeah, we need way more action. Come on, man. Listen, I, I, I respect everybody's anger. I mean, sure. you know, we're uh, we go through this. Right. If I'm on a plane, they probably kick me off a plane. I mean, who yeah. knows? But right. And you're talking <laughs> wow. to a guy that was that boy crazy. Nah, no, yeah, no, I, I want to touch on that. Yeah, you're talking to a guy that you know, if you would have spoke to me 20 years ago, I'm hyper. You know, but now. Violence ain't the answer, man. Burn sure. that shit down. We just Maturity. look stupid. I mean, yeah, yeah. we got to take it. We got to handle it in different ways. Right. Yeah. got to be smarter. And we got to be the example. We have to be the example. Yeah. No, 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 no I, mean, I mean, what he just said happened like a month ago. These uh, Muslims, they were on a plane, and he was talking to his yeah. mother um, in Arabic. And I guess it like made passengers afraid, afraid yeah. so they went to the pilot or you know whatever and got him kicked off. So he filmed it. You know he went live and said, "Listen, I'm being kicked off of this plane right now because I was speaking Arabic because I was on the phone with my mom." Uh, ignorance, crazy. Pure ignorance. Yeah, you got a couple crazy. of questions, Monty. What's up? Uh, go back up, Ray. Yeah. So did you uh, did you have any doubts or fears of, of failures of when course. you started your uh, oh, business? Yeah. Anxiety. Oh, how did you overcome them? What's her name? Uh, my feet. My, my feet. feet. It's called anxiety. Mm. It kicks in heavily, of course. But you gotta have heart. You gotta believe in God mm -hmm. and move on, man. Yes, of course. That's tough, man. I mean, that's a good question. Yeah. yeah fear is huge. Yeah. I mean, fear is huge. I mean, it's. What was uh, one of your biggest fears, though? Like this thing ain't gonna work, or like yeah, yeah, what of course. I, I mean, first like, of all, you're signing a, a personal guarantee. I mean, you know, like I said, when you dot your line with Nike, that's a personal guarantee. Yeah, that boy, that's a that's a big dot. Yeah, that's boy. not no. Uh, there ain't no. Uh, I'm gonna get something <laughs> no, back. No, they gonna make you or break you. Yeah, well, Nike. Nike and Jordan. When you sign <laughs> them dotted lines, people don't realize that's a personal guarantee. Any shoe that walks in the door is a personal guarantee. Wow. So yeah, yeah, there's fears. I mean, now there's still fears. I mean, to maintain it, I might be in a better position, but at the same time, it's. Like a recession, when we went through the recession, right. I mean. Oh, man, I bet that was tough. It's very tough. Yeah. People are, I mean, are buying less. Don't forget, less. man, you got a wife and kids at home. Right. Mm -hmm. You go home frustrated, man, it is your whole day. Right. <laughs> it is. Yeah. 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 So, I mean, but, but you got your pros and your cons. I mean, you could take a vacation, you come back, and, but there's, you know, it's stressful, man. Mm -hmm. You know, <clears throat> you want my advice to everybody? If you're not, if you're young and you're business-minded, Take your rear to school, man. Get an education. Mm. Right there. there I tell my son all day, man. Forget about hang time. Get an education. Mm. Right. That's going to benefit you more. Your son wants to do hang time? He wants to be like daddy? Uh, you know what? He's he's smart and he's, he's aggressive, but at the end of the day, I tell him, man, you got to do something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because... Yeah. Retail like Macy's. I mean, you guys read the news. I mean, Macy's. Right, 68,000 employees. employees. Going oh, on employees. Tight. None here in Indy, but they closed. Hey, uh, I think another store too. Uh, Jason limited. Kenny's or limited. Some other stores going. There. So it's tough. Yeah, there's fears. Yeah. Fears is huge. Gotcha. Listen, payroll goes up every year. Your rent goes up every year. Mm -hmm. Sales stay the same. Right. Four. Wow. That's 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 big right there. Yeah. Because you you either looking at charging that to the consumer. <laughs> or you eat it. And you can't charge to the consumer because obviously yeah. it's all pre-regulated. Right. You know, if Nike wants to charge them or, or, or Jordan or Adidas right. does, that's fine. But we can't. Right. Because you know, they have their own set rates. It's all regulated, man. Wow. Yeah. So that's
That's why people, you know, they come in, oh, why is your price so high? Yo, I don't set them prices. <laughs> I don't yeah, set them prices. Set prices. Yeah. Yeah. Certain things we set, like, which is minor accessories, mm -hmm. that's about it, but 99% of my prices is regulated. But the key to our business is, is getting the customer in a relationship, you know, there it is. giving them a discount mm -hmm. here and there, knowing who's your regular, who's not your regular. Yeah. You know, you got to, you know, greeting the people, uh, giving back to the community. Mm -hmm. uh, even people just come in, like Duke would come in, just dap and leave. Yeah, I will. Yeah. I, I, I will. I, I, you no, know, no, I'm just saying. For a minute, I was paying the rent. I was paying the rent around there for a minute. Then I, you know, come in. Dap necessarily, you don't have to come in and yeah. drop people. You know? mm -hmm. right. Come in and buy some, you know. Have you ever been there, Ray? To Hangtown? Yeah. Yeah, I've been in there a couple uh, times. No. Yeah. Have you been there? Yeah. I know a lot of people want to know, man. What the hell you do with that damn calculator? Right? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Mike, he was calculating. Uh, uh, uh. People, people, people laugh at that calculator. But hey, that's how you get that's your how discount. That's how you get your discount, yeah. boy. Uh, Simple. Uh, uh, you know what the formula is? That's the formula. You put your products on there, and you add the 7% tax that mm -hmm. I pay I Indianapolis Department of Revenue monthly. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Trust then me, I do you, too. You, it depends on the discount. The discount. That's how you do it. That's how you do That's it. That's the formula. There's no trick keys. There's no... Hey, yo, there it is. Trick 7%. Number. You got to pay them taxes. <laughs> oh, you know what I'm saying? You got to pay them taxes. So, you know. But no, I, I know a lot of people be like, man, money got their calculator. So I, I asked, which I probably didn't want to ask. I asked it for y'all. You know what I'm okay. saying? That's Seven percent. Yeah, it is. You gotta pay the. You gotta pay Uncle Sam, man. You gotta pay the. You think the economy is better since the recession? Yes. And so, so business and sales have improved. Um. It, it you know it's steady. Steady. You know, I want to say improved. I think now we you know you look at your projections and say you know you want to be two percent, three percent, five percent, ten percent more than last year. Yeah, but you know, as years go by, you just want to be steady, right? You know, has it improved? I think mentally, it has improved for everybody. I mean, right. I think that's where the media came in, mm -hmm. like, you know, recession, recession, right, recession. right, right, yeah. But you know, I, I just think that steady, man, just just be steady. I'm not, you know, just live a good life and right. and, and, and enjoy my family, and enjoy the customers, man. I love being there. Some people don't like going to work. I like going to work. <laughs> hey, that's awesome. There it is. I mean, as a as a person of business, you gotta have that repetitive behavior, uh, nature about you to be able to have a business. I mean, you gotta you gotta be a consistent. My key is to everybody: you gotta be patient. Patient. Because when you're dealing with thirty customers, you don't know what the twenty ninth person, what kind of day he had, or right. the twenty fifth. He could have lost his house. Right. He could have lost his son. He could have lost his. Right. Life. You don't know. I mean, you don't know what they're going through. So you try right. to. And I tell my guys all the time, and I tell myself too, you gotta be patient yeah. and respect. Mm -hmm. You gotta respect. I mean, yeah, there's days you get out of pocket, there's days you get <laughs> anxious, there's days you get, you know, you're gonna encounter some ignorance. Mm -hmm. But. So your biggest joy every day is a customer? Is my biggest what? Joy every day going in, going into work is customer. I see my regulars, of course. Yeah. We shoot the shit, we talk, you know, everybody yeah. wants to shit on my bulls and, and, and my bag, <laughs> and, you know, everybody wants to go Bulls, the Bulls. So are y'all keeping Rondo or not? No, he's out. He's, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> I, I liked Rondo, but his attitude, I don't know what it is. Yeah. That's every team, yo. Yeah, every I mean, team. he lasted in Boston. For a little while. Well, that's they need to call the Tubby, They need to call Tubby Smith and ask him, man, how'd you do it at Kentucky, man? Man, the court in the Boston. The college coach is. always knows. Yeah. What they're talking about, uh, getting, uh, what's his name, from the Pelicans, is it? Or, Who? From Davis? Anthony Davis? Yes. Oh, wow. Bring him back home? Don't do that. Don't do that to Anthony Davis. This was, this was I don't know Chicago if people can, or, or. Chicago play, boys can't hang out in Chicago, man. Yeah, yeah. I mean, no, nobody can hang on. Don't sit like... Uh, I'm just saying, they don't do well. Chicago... Look at George. Look where he went and look what he's doing. Was he back? I don't know if he's back yet. Who? George, uh... George Hill. No, back he's to in uh, Utah. He's Utah. in Utah. But yeah. he's doing all-star wow. numbers. He's balling because there's nothing in Utah. You know, is it the system or is it the city? Both. Man. It's, your, system. it's your system and the circle. Well, yeah, they yeah, didn't yeah. let circle. George. They, they wanted to turn Utah George into like, just a point guard, but George is a shooting guard. He likes to score. I mean, he can I do mean, both. Look at IUPUI. He, when he, I yeah. mean, he he was uh, versatile and could score at any time. Yeah. And you can see that even when he played with the Pacers, like when in clutch time, he would come out with threes. And I mean, so just, do you think the Pacers is is it the system? I think it's system. I think Pacers. it's both. I think it's both, man. I think it's uh, man, Pacers ain't set up to win, bro. 
Why wouldn't you I, I really define I think that? Both. I, I think it's both. It. I don't think they want to win. I think they want to stay in the market where they are, get enough, go to the playoffs, do just enough to get you beat. Nah. <laughs> no player nah. wakes up with that mentality. No player does, but the owners do. Birds well, what do they get up? Hey, man. Birds I don't know what they get up. Huh? Like, nah, man, I doubt Birds is thinking like that. Man, the last time we had a chance to win, we had all of them. They did. They it's not on the court, though. It, yeah, it doesn't Steve, matter. When I, when I, when we had Steven uh, Jackson. What I, noticed, what I noticed from being here is when the team is hot, the city vibe is hot. Yeah. Right. Yeah. right. When the vibe is hot. Yeah. But you got you gotta realize where we're in Indiana. Low, we got the vibe is low. <laughs> when you're in Indiana, you gotta please some certain people. I don't know, yeah. Duke. See, you guys are into that theory. Now, see, see, ain't see, no Duke, theory, Duke, man. I'm from Duke, here, man. Duke hey, guess take what? That guess what? Angle no, 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 I ain't talking about no Illuminati, man. I'm just trying to tell y'all we're a basketball state. He needs to come and talk to my one of my employees, Jonas. I run away from this. Oh man, we're a basketball. Look, man, we're a basketball state. We don't even be hot. We be worried about the Colts, man. <laughs> Come is, on, man. Is, is, is Paul George sticking around? Terrible, by the way. Is he what? Is he sticking around? Hell no. Paul George is gone. He back to the west side. I doubt he's it, man. He's not going to turn down all that money, bro. Huh? He's not going to turn down all of that money. Man, to go live on the west coast, I bet you do. He would have to turn down about $60 million. He's not turning <laughs> down $60 million to leave to go back to California. If somebody over there give him that bread. They can't. Because the way that that uh, the new collective yeah, bargaining agreement is set up, all the TV deals are with it. It's so way different it's now. Gonna be See, interesting. Yeah. He can sign. He can sign for like a five year, one eighty or two hundred. Have you brokered brokered any deals with any of the sports teams here? Like anybody? anybody Honestly, I mean, no, no, no. We deal with a lot of them on a personal level. Okay. My brother does mainly. Okay. Um. Uh. So I mean, we do a lot of. I wouldn't say private stuff for him. I mean, you know, we had. It's crazy. You you brought that up. Adam Vinatieri came in. Oh, nice, nice. The nice. Guy oh, was, man, he's my favorite. <laughs> yo, the guy was, he was, they, they were telling me he was more hip than you and I. Really? Yeah, I can yeah, believe yeah. it. Yeah. Then you got to think, the kicker would be some of the coolest dudes on the team. And not just that, how, yeah. how long has he been in the league? Yeah, he's just, about like, what, 20, 20 years. 20 years around. Everybody, 50 everybody. Like he's, 20. he's been yeah. around nothing but young, hip athletes. Young, hip athletes, so he stayed The guy fresh. came in asking for some slim moto jeans. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> And this is what he was, he was like, what? Wow. Keep having the time. Yeah. Hey, so, you know, you never know who walks in because our 56 location is close to the facility. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, yeah. the Colts are, you know, class act. Uh, yep. Pacers, our funnest run was when we had the Tinsley, the, the Jackson. That was fun. Uh, yeah. But, you know, yeah, they was getting their fights off the court and off hey, the man, court. Hey, man, but they was winning, dog. <laughs> that, they honestly, was winning, that's man. That's the lightest I've seen this ever right. I mean, since, you know. They, was they were more aggressive. They was winning, bro. They were more aggressive. And the people around here don't want that. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Duke, man. We got conspiracies, man. I'm just um, telling you. Listen, man. I'm with you. It's you a black and white state, bro. But to answer A customer means more to me than... Right. A ball player that's signed for one year and he's going to leave there next year. Man, I wish yeah. most business owners uh, thought about that, man. That's incredible. It's not welcome. Yeah. I mean, nothing against yeah. the guy, but yeah. Yeah. no, it's your story. My guy has been shopping with us for ten years, of course. He comes and so goes. How, how do you how do you manage that? Like, I've noticed you get a lot of lot of hot artists that come through your store. How do you? Is that just word of mouth? That's it. I mean, big ups to all the promoters. You know who you are. I mean, you know guys we mess with and, and yeah. guys that respect us and we respect them. I mean, mm -hmm. uh, you know, uh, you know, Worm TC, all those good dudes. I mean, you know, it's. Anybody that brings the artist, I mean, they know that we're the spot. Yeah. I'm not saying that out of arrogance, yeah. but, you know, and then we take care of them and as in promote them. I mean, it's, it's, it sure. goes two ways. I mean, it works both sides, but artists, am I, you know, I've been around artists all my life. I mean, am I impressed? No. I mean, some of them are, okay, whatever, you know. Right. I mean, but it's good to have. But at the end of the day, it's... Good people again. Yeah. Yeah. Do you yeah. jump in that game? I know we have like promoters here and people mm. that kind of bring people. That's their thing. Do you jump in I that don't, game? No, no, no. But I promote. I'll help promote. I'll promote. Yeah, yeah. I won't there you go. physically jump in the game, but mm. I'll help promote. And 
I, I, stay in your lane. You do what you do. There, there it is. Stay in your lane. Stay in your lane. There's guys that know what they're doing. And right. Guys do that shit with their eyes closed. Sweet. Yeah. I can't do it. I can't. I don't have patience for those guys. Important message. <laughs> I can't I mean, so I have patience for them. And I can't imagine him saying he used to be more and more like oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. animated and stuff. I can't it, imagine that. But yeah, I mean, it's it's. It, I was. I mean, I'm a lot more humble than I am. Comes with growth, man. Yeah, yeah, that comes mm-hmm. with growth. It comes yeah. with experience. I mean, mm-hmm. you got kids now, man. Yeah. yeah. I mean, maturity. Yeah. Maturity. Yeah. You have Sweet. to be, man, because my mom would get me in trouble. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my wife, if she's listening, she knows that. Yeah. He tells me shit. He just uh, sometimes. Did you get vacations? You know what I do, but are they vacations? Right. <laughs> Staycations. Yeah, because you still got you still worry about what's going on in oh, the home man. front. You know what? And yeah. sometimes there's times. Is Jonas really doing what he's supposed to be doing? My brother doing what he's supposed to be doing. <laughs> no, I think I got. You know, thank God I don't worry about my stuff. Yeah. Right. In that aspect. Yeah. But you worry about it. I mean, rents coming up, taxes. I mean, you know, you got. You know, Nike's trying to ship, and this guy's shipping. I mean, you got bills due. I mean, it's it's nonstop. Your brain is right. Can I turn my phone off? No. no. I wish I could turn my phone off. Now we used to say, you know, I I hate whoever invented email. Mm, Our yeah. businesses, I get about two three hundred emails a day. I have to reply. To. Whoa. Whoa. That one email leads to fifteen. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so you yeah. do the math on the vendors, right. right? Especially when it's. Like right now, we're, we're buying for three, Q3 of 2017. We're mm-hmm. doing our buys. Yeah. You know, Nike and Jordan's are on Friday. Mm-hmm. You do the wow. math. You do the math on the emails. Wow. You know, why isn't the SKU number on there? Or how right. many units am I getting? Or, right. yo, uh, what's my budget? Or, right. Wow. So, emails is, uh, in Where's fact, it? I just got back. I visited my sister in Maryland, D.C. Mm-hmm. area. I love D.C., by the way. Yeah. yeah. Crab cakes. Oh, man. Baltimore, eh. Yeah. It's all right. That's all I hear out there about Baltimore, man. Oh, they, they, they will, they anybody there will tell you, go yeah. to go to, to get the crack hat. Yeah, I can't, the harbor. I, crack yeah. cakes. I can't remember the place out there. It's, there was it's, one it's, place that's right at the harbor. Like like it's, harbor. it's at the harbor. I used to go there all the time. I, said, I don't know the name of it. Sorry, but it's right at the harbor. Yeah. So we were yeah. having a lazy day, and you know, we were in a hotel, and I'm doing work. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> work. You're talking about vacation. So do I really get a vacation? Yeah. <laughs> Sundays is probably my best day of the week. It's just a change of environment, but the work is rest day, man. Sundays Company's are rest day, man. <coughs> no emails. Yeah. Yeah, employees go home early. Yeah. And it's my family. Dad, it's family. It's yeah. Sunday lazy day. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But when NFL is gone, ah, it's a little dry. <laughs> what? How do you handle holidays? NBA. Come on, man. You got the NBA. You yeah, yeah. There is no holidays in retail. Yeah. Period. It's important. That's a message right there. No there holidays, holidays, holidays in retail. Retail is a drug. Man. Only way you make it. There is no holidays. I mean, unless you're working some corporate. Even the malls, you know, these days they don't close. Like the malls don't close no more. I know it's money. You don't have a closed day, do you? No, 365. We closed probably twice. Yeah. Wow. And that's okay. when that uh, the governor had that uh, icy storm. No, nobody could leave. But two right. three years ago. Yeah. yeah. Oh mm-hmm. yeah. Cause I know it's I'll be you know I check his the, they social media I'm like damn they open on New Year's yeah, yeah. Hey, yeah. Bro, you know what I mean big. Christmas Day that's the best I mean like mm-hmm. Mike's like come yeah, on I mean, in here minute, come on in here get that seven percent baby yeah. 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 <laughs> we got a question from um, from Facebook what company do you see as your biggest competition I'm assuming they mean in, in locally company yeah honestly when you start looking at competition you lose yeah. Hey man, that's I a good agree. point. That's a I good agree. point. That's a good point. <laughs> there shouldn't be no competition no. because you're the no, only no, one that no, do what not, you do. Not, right? Yeah, yeah. Not everybody has a different lane. I mean, right. Yeah. Do you and worry about yourself? And right yeah. now, when you go home and you close the door, do you worry about Duke's yeah. carpet or his couch or his? No. It's the same thing. There it is. I don't pay attention. So I love them. I mean, I have a good relationship with people that consider them competition. Mm-hmm. It's crazy. Right. I joke, laugh with them. Yeah. You know, if yeah. we see each other at trade shows, I, I shake hands with them. Mm-hmm. It's, 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 only, it's only business. Right? It's only right. business. It's not right. personal. Right. There it, there it is. Uh, Another question is, how do you separate work from home and oh, family man. time? <laughs> it comes <laughs> home. It possible? It comes home. It, it, it comes home. It, comes it home. took a lot for me to leave it out. Like, if you get one incident, it'll stick with you. Yeah, you right. know, it's, uh, it's, yeah, it comes home, but yeah. you try to, I wish I wasn't so dedicated to bring it home, I mean, there's times, yeah, I'm a lot better, 
Do you do you feel? And this is a big one. We we were gonna talk about this. Women who support you, mm-hmm. you know, is it better for them to support you from the home or you know being in their place of business? How how involved do you get? Do you want them involved, or is that is there is there an imbalance there? It just depends on the woman. Honestly, like my wife. I mean, I'll, I'll tell you guys straight up. I mean, uh, she don't get involved at all. I mean, you know, yeah, of course she talks as a wife and she's going to put her input and you're going to respect her. But mm-hmm. what I love about her is do you. Right. Mm-hmm. You know, don't mm-hmm. worry about me and the kids. And, you know, she's, you know, my wife mm-hmm. came from the bottom too. I mean, that's yeah. what I love about her too. So, yeah. so she respects it. And she they said, don't realize, not to cut you off, but they don't realize like, you know, when you started with them back then mm-hmm. that you have them in mind later on. Of course. They have to understand that they're, yeah. gonna, when they're you, always going to be there. She was patient with me, and I was patient, you know. But she was more patient than I was, and for sure, she deserves what she got now. And there it is. She's uh, she's a writer. She earned her stripes. She did. <laughs> but you, you, sh- your question is: Should they get involved in business? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah, I agree. Why do you? Why? What? What's? It's a conflict of interest. Absolutely. So let's just say you have an argument with your wife at work. You mm-hmm. think when she goes home, she's gonna turn the light switch on and say, "Hey, babe, how you doing?" Right. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, we're gonna take this all the way home. On the ride on the ride. Good point. Yeah. 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 My, my wife doesn't get involved and I respect cool. her for that. Yeah. That's awesome. That's uh so we got separate. Absolutely. Good. Absolutely. Any other uh questions? Uh let's see here. I know we had skipped over some but Facebook is man, it just it just keeps going and going and going. Nah, I missed it. It's down there somewhere. We'll get back to it. But man, this is man. This has been a pleasure having you, man. Absolutely. Sure. I, I mean, this is great. Too. You know, um, to be able to have the man himself. You know, you're like a celebrity to me. No, cause I hear, <laughs> but but I hear about you. And, and this is and this is just something I want to explain. When people ask me what I like about people, I can you. I think they come from a perspective of what they actually do in their daytime or whatever. Sure. And, a, and, a, and a, an example would be like Floyd Mayweather. Um, and you know, I don't I don't like Floyd Mayweather as a person. You know, I, I think he's a great boxer, but what he does off the sure. off the map, it doesn't add up. Of course. So I take that into account when I when I'm talking to people and they ask me about certain people, and I can honestly mm-hmm. say that you know what you do on and off the court, you know, and what you do is is commended. No, I appreciate that. And thank, thank you, you, thank you for yeah, you know being right. who you are in this community. You have to be, man. I mean, for sure. You got to be humble. Yeah. That's, that's my pleasure. And hopefully, it's. Bigger things are coming. Uh, Absolutely, it will. I said, yeah, yeah, it will. I mean, yeah. I'm, I'm uh, honestly, this is, uh, and I should have reached out to Duke when we did that event, but I was, I think I was overwhelmed. Plus, we caught that storm that day. Yeah, <laughs> uh, yeah, 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 yeah. All good. You know, we'll we'll continue to you know build with you. Like, you have anything That's going good. on? Let us know. We'll, we'll we will. We will. We're gonna you know plan it out the right way. For sure. And uh, even if we do one big event a year, right? So I mean. I promise it is going to be an event year. Awesome. Sweet. Okay. What, what we're doing and how we're doing it, we don't know yet. But okay. it will be an event every year. And it's 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 our yearly event to give back. For sure. Okay. Sweet. Right. And this is all funded by Haynes. I mean, it's not awesome. no corporate sponsors. No, sponsors. No, 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 no. I don't know. We're good. Yep. Now, down the line, excuse me, if we want to make it some big, who knows? Hopefully, it will. I mean, as long as it feeds or helps families out, I don't care. Absolutely. Donald Trump himself put some money up. And there it is. In Indianapolis, if you're out there, if you want to, you want to get in Hence. touch with Hang Time, and you want to support the movement, you know, if I'm helping and you know, make make it something to where it's, it's for the community, for the people, get in touch with him. Yeah, no you doubt. Know? And I appreciate that. And thank you. And I love the city. And I love the people. And I love you guys. And uh, Jake, you. you've always been a class act. And a positive guy, man, and uh, keep doing what you're doing. You got two beautiful guys with you, man, and uh, stand Appreciate up, it, man. man. And, uh, Appreciate it. Hopefully, like I said, one day you guys could get up there with us. Yeah, yes, it. yes. We're going to do closing remarks. If you could say anything to the people in Indianapolis, you know, what would you say? Uh, Both but business and for honestly, you know, it, it's it's it is. They know how I feel. I mean, I'm, yeah, Naptown. I mean, without you guys, there is no hang time. Uh, period. I, I love the city. I love the people, and uh, hopefully they can love us back, and uh, we can continue to grow. And uh, let's do some community work. Awesome. And that's it. And thanks for having me. That's, that's I appreciate it. it man. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna close the day. Said uh, first and foremost, I want to thank my homie for coming through. 
support me. Appreciate it, Monty. Man, you always been a stand up guy. Uh, ever since I met you, so I always, you know, always much respect to you. Appreciate what you're doing. Um, and you know, my my remarks are, you know, mine's are always short. It's just the model of my company, man. Don't be good, be great, in whatever you do. Absolutely. Hey, man, listen, it's been a pleasure, you know, meeting you, man. Um, I mean, I love the fact that God is your foundation. Of course. You know, I'm the exact same way with everything that I do. So just, you know, listen to you. It's like, wow, you know, it's, I mean, it feels good to like hear that. I mean, I see both sides of the world, man. Yeah, you know, I don't want to get to the dark side and, and stories and <laughs> right. that's done. You know, I got two kids, three kids, and, uh, and a wife and my mom, my brothers, and God first, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, so when, when God is your foundation, like your perspective is righteousness. I mean, I mean, you just think about doing the right thing. So, mm -hmm. yeah. so you know, whatever help you need, man. Hey, you know, same with us. It. It's likewise, and hopefully we can help each other grow. Yes, sir. Uh, for those people who are listeners in Indianapolis, real quick, could you let them know your location? Uh, we got two locations, uh, 38th and Meridian, which is 11 East 38th Street. And our second location is uh, 56 in Georgetown, which is a Morris Plaza, 5660 yeah. Georgetown Road. Thank you. No, thank uh, you. And uh, to close it out again, <laughs> these guys said it too. Thank you for coming. You know, I'm sure we'll, we'll see you again in the future we'd love to have you on yeah. next time maybe we could talk about sports bring your brother yeah. you know, so we can, we can yeah. get it in I'll, I'll, I'll come back to the store <laughs> I'll bring, bring together you guys can get on hey listen I'm coming back to the store so, as long as my cubby's won <laughs> hey, uh, no, 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 you know, you're good with that but to close it out, man, this has been great. Um, you know, we'll have you on again. Um, you know, the team, uh, the great area, I just ask that you guys continue to support the great area. Our goal and our mission is always to provide a voice for the community um, and to help us, you know, get, get the things out there that are not being known. If you know anybody that's doing something in the community and is just being great uh, as a person, as an individual, let us know. We'd love to get them on here and have conversations with them and let them know uh, that there are good people out there. You know, our communities are not filled with violence and hatred we actually have people out there doing great things so let this be the, the, the voice for that and that platform for you um, um, this is the the gray area go to our website at www.thegrayareamedialive.com um, make sure that you sh please share this share this get the word out there so that we can continue to be